So hello everybody and welcome to another film. This particular film is all based here, right in my little studio. We're not going out doing any photography today. I wanted to do a small catch up video about the case filter system that I've been using for coming up for about a year now. So those of you that watch the channel will know that prior to that I used to use Lee filters and I was sent a set of case filters earlier on the year to try and I used them for about three months and I absolutely love them. I did a video review of them I think in June this year I'll put a link to that above but these are absolutely superb. They're all paid for by me um, so it's not uh, paid for review so don't worry about that it's not a hard sell I just want to say how good they are but there's been some changes recently um, in the case filter system and that is they've now brought out a new K9 filter holder and that's what I wanted to talk to you about today I've not looked inside this box so this is a little bit of an unboxing um, video today but <laughs> personally I'm not really into them but um, I know that there's plenty of you out there that are into unboxing videos so I wanted to show you this for the first time as I speak it's now October early October this doesn't come out till November so this video will be going live in November but um, this is um, very much tight-lipped at the moment so inside the box you get the new K9 holder slightly bigger than the old holder you get a bigger 90 millimeter magnetic CPL filter circular polarizer you get a 77 to 82 millimeter actually you get two of those magnetic geared adapter rings 72 and an 82 millimeter sorry you get a 67 to 82 millimeter and a 72 to 82 millimeter step up ring so for two different lenses you also get some additional fins so that if you wanted to use more than two filters you can you can put additional fins on as well so let's have a look in the box I've already taken the cellophane wrapper off but the um, box is beautiful and it's probably going to be quite difficult to get in it's, um, it's very very tightly packed so back in a second so opening that up straight away you can see lovely nice black foam insert they've gone to great lengths to make them look very beautiful when you open the boxes very well presented so here we have the new K9 filter holder so I'm going to compare that against the old one I think that's the best best way to do this so there we have the old K8 um, and as I've said already slightly bigger as you can see at the top this this little raised bit and at the bottom to take a bigger polarise and the reason they've done that is because the 16 to 35 millimeter Sony and the Nikon 14 to 35 millimeter lens both had vignetting issues um, when you were using the old holder with the polarizer. So case have addressed that. So those of you that use Sony and Nikon um, lenses, especially the 14 to 35 and the 16 to 35 mil Sony, certainly an improvement um, for, for you that have those lenses. So the next improvement that Case has made with this new K9 fold is the wheel on the side. Comparing to the old one, you can only just see it. This one, it really stands out. So if you've got gloves on, it's cold. It's not such a problem to, to get to. Personally speaking, I didn't really have a big problem with that, with that wheel, but having said that, I've not used it in the depths of winter, so who knows. But they've made it bigger nonetheless, so it's, it's certainly easier to use. The second development that they've done is in terms of this little wheel here they look the same but what they've done is they've put a, a larger thread on the actual the, the sprocket that goes through so when you turn it the actual bit that holds the geared ring in place it takes less of a turn to make the whole clamp move backwards and forwards so it's quicker to use and the old one to be fair was a little bit you had to sort of keep on doing it and eventually the polarizer will pop out it's not significant but it's a small improvement but for me the biggest improvement and if I can just find it so this is inside the rest of the box you've got the step up rings you've got the additional fins and you've got the polarizer I presume it's the polarizer it's the bigger of the of the, of the two packets here I presume that's a polarizer the new 90 mil CPL so I'll pop that out and we'll just place that inside inside the new holder nice and quick and the polarizer as always with the case it's the magnetic CPL so that just drops 
into place there. So the big change on the filter holder is getting the polarizer out was a little bit difficult when you had the filter holder in place. When you took the filter holder off, it was easy enough to get your nail inside and flick, flick the polarizer out. But with the with the with the filter holder in place, it was a bit difficult. So what they've done is they've put this lug. You see that indentation there? Hopefully that's focusing. You can now get your finger inside quite easily and pop the polarizer out with relative ease. That that is certainly the one thing that I think above all else is the most important uh, modification they've made to the system. Now, the K8, the older filter system, in case I've said that they're still going to support it, um, so those of you that have bought this filter system, no need to worry in that respect. And to be honest, unless you're using the Sony or the Nikon wide-angle lenses, this is still perfectly good. and. Um, is not a problem. I would just say that if, you, if you're going to if you're going to be using those two lenses, maybe consider getting the new K9 filter holder instead. So that just about wraps this film up. Um, there we have it, the new K9 filter holder. I will just say, and I'm not sure if I've said it in a previous in the previous film, that on the likes of the Lee filters, certainly when you're using the uh, the big stopper and the little stopper, the gaskets are on the filter. Um, you may notice that on the case filters, on the case filters themselves, that there's no gasket, and that's because the gasket in this instance is it's attached to the actual filter holder itself. Um, so yeah, a lovely, lovely bit of quality kit. It's all made out of lovely lightweight aluminium. So really, really nicely engineered. So there we have it, the case new K9 filter holder. I hope you've enjoyed the video, um, as always please subscribe, leave some comments below, let me know what you think of this, if you've already got a case filter system, love to hear your comments, like I said already, affiliate link below if you want to buy any case filter products, it'd be really helpful to me if, um, if you could use that link, um, it's an affiliate link and I, I get a small percentage for every purchase made. So until next time, thank you for watching, I'll see you all soon, bye for now.